welcome to my channel. We've got a fun one for you today. We got the United States president representing the Washington Redskins versus the 2016 New England Patriots, who are obviously going to be representing the AFC in Super Bowl 51. And we kick it off, and Franklin Pierce sends it through the back of the end zone. So the Patriots will have the ball at 25-yard line. Now, I got this idea considering that uh, the new president, Donald Trump, was just inaugurated a little over three weeks ago, two or three weeks ago. And so I thought it would be great to see a team of United States presidents. And their heights and weights are accurate to their true heights and weights. However, uh, their ratings are given by their margin of victory in the Electoral College. Uh, and then those scores are root scored, root curved. And so basically what that means is if somebody won 70% of the Electoral College, you take 70 times, you take the square root of 70, multiply it by 10, and each, pos each rating for that position is given that score. And so what this means is that a lot of the earlier presidents uh, are represented more heavily in the starting lineup because elections have become more and more divisive. But you'll still see, as a matter of fact, there's George H.W. Bush coming off a tackle. He's very talented as he won that election. And there he makes another swatted ball. So now the Patriots have it third and 11 on their first drive from the 40-yard line. And we're going to get the tackle there. And that's Ricky Jean Francois. And as I mentioned earlier, there's only 44 presidents. And since you have to have 53 on the roster, uh, there are a few players that are actual NFL players as we dump it off to James K. Polk and pick up a first down. Now George Washington's going to be playing quarterback. We've got Dwight Eisenhower in the backfield and we get him the ball here and a gain of 11 yards to the 33 yard line. So we're moving the ball really nicely here on the first drive and we take John Quincy Adams and uh, on play action we pick up a couple of yards there. Get the first down to the 20 after a holding call and a wide receiver screen that goes out of bounds and counted as a fumble. It's now third and 25 after that incompletion. And so we're gonna take the sack here and that'll actually move us out of field goal range. So the drive had gotten into the red zone but stalled out and now we had to punt the ball away. Now the Patriots have it second and seven on the 23. They're gonna run a draw. Garrett Blunt, and that's going to be third and inches, I believe, yes. And they'll hand the ball off and get it there. George H.W. on the tackle again. And here's Donald Trump, oh, getting juked out of his shoes and looking silly, which is something he's going to have to get used to for a couple of years, as Martellus Bennett absolutely destroys William Henry Harrison there. And so, but there's a flag, and it looks like this one's going to be coming back. And it's holding on the offense. So now it's first and 20. And Brady looking. Somehow they say that's incomplete. So now it's second and 20. And looks like Donald Trump on the stop there. Third and 14. And George H.W. Bush on the tackle again. Richard Nixon back to return the punt with a sick juke move, but then immediately brought down. There's Abe Lincoln getting involved for the first time, six foot four wide receiver. Um, let's see, we got Thomas Jefferson there picking up some real estate, just like the Louisiana Purchase. And here we're going deep, taking a deep shot for Andrew, no, Thomas Jefferson rather. And lucky that one was wasn't intercepted. We run a little bit of read option on second and ten with Washington and don't pick up anything. Going deep here again, this time for Jackson, and it's incomplete. Uh, gonna get a fair catch here. And New England will have the ball at the 29 yard line, first and 10. My video glitches out a little bit there, but it looks like Bill Clinton on the tackle. And here we got John Tyler making the tackle, third and five. And oh, we just miss out on the sack there with Donald Trump, but instead Richard Nixon will have to return this punt and we'll start at the 28 yard line. Looking to go deep again and these deep shots just aren't panning out for us, which is not going to be good for us because our, and we throw a pick there as we just underthrow the receiver. Um, our receivers have a lot of speed, but we don't really have the blocking to be able to um, run any sort of play action or anything that takes a long time to develop. As we give up the touchdown here, and New England gets on the board first. And so we really need to be able to get separation and be able to throw the ball down the field as uh, we can't find anybody there and throw, throw the ball away. 
We're going to pick up the first down here to LBJ. And now we got first and 10 on the 42. We're going to go deep again. And just the aggressive catch not happening for us today. So looking to throw it, but we get a sack here. Now right before halftime, we're just going to try to do something. And uh, this is kind of silly. We're out on the run, and we throw an interception to Malcolm Butler. So Tom Brady's going to have a couple of seconds before halftime to see what he can do. There's uh, George W. Bush on the tackle. Keep that from being a bigger gain than it needed to be. And Brady looking back, dropping, going to throw a Hail Mary. And that's going to be incomplete, and that's halftime. So we do get the ball coming out of the half, which means that we're hoping that we can put the ball in the end zone as Eisenhower is stuffed for a loss of two. We're going to try to get the running game going in the second half, but uh, we throw another gotcha, bitch. horrible interception on the run. And so now uh, all of those hopes of coming back and tying it up after halftime are done. And so now we got to hope our defense can be locked down. Donald Trump and I can't tell who else on the tackle there. Martellus Bennett is going to pick up the third down and one and go a long way, running past William Henry Harrison. They're going to have first and goal at the seven-yard line, the handoff to LeGarrette Blunt, stuffed by Donald Trump. Now John Tyler just absolutely blowing the play up in the backfield. Tom Brady looking to throw on third and goal, and that's going to be incomplete. So we force them to take the field goal. It's now 10-0. Which is a little bit alarming because we haven't been able to move the ball very well. But we're going to run a wide receiver screen here. Lincoln breaks the tackle but can't do anything with it. So even though it's only a two-score game, we haven't been able to move the football. And it's a little bit troubling. So here we take a sack. And a loss of 11 yards. I should have punted the ball here, but just a little bit of frustration getting to me. So now the Patriots are going to have the ball first and goal at the 9. Incomplete and a holding penalty. So now first and goal at the 19. Second goal at the 12 now, and Brady looking to throw. It's Bennett at the 8-yard line. Um, third and goal from the 8, Brady looking to throw. Got nothing open, takes the hit, and so now it's 13 nothing, and we haven't been able to do anything, so that's a little bit of the problem as we try to run some read option there and absolutely get stuffed. But we're going to go deep to Andrew Jackson, and he got his man beat. And we're going to go 73 yards for the touchdown. And that's going to make it a one-score game right before the end of the third quarter. So now we're hoping that we can just get a couple of stops here and get the ball down the field as Brady overthrows what looked like an open receiver. LeGarrette Blunt gets stuffed on the draw by George W. Bush. But now on third and nine, Tom Brady, an absolute dart. And that's going to pick it up for the Patriots as time is starting to become a factor. They're going to just keep handing the ball off to Blunt, and he picks up the first down. Looks like John Kennedy made that tackle, and there's George W. Bush starting to make his presence felt. And there's Donald Trump whiffing on a tackle, but luckily Richard Nixon there to finish it off for him. Brady looking to throw an incomplete. So now the Patriots are going to attempt a long field goal, which would make it a two-score game, but it's no good. So Gostowski misses from 56. Gonna hand the ball off to Eisenhower. Now we got three minutes. We're gonna try to take as much time off the clock, but we also do need to put the ball in the end zone to be able to win this football game. We could pick up that third down to LBJ. Going nowhere on first down with Eisenhower. Hit the two minute warning. And looks like George Washington's gonna run with it. Pick up the first down. Now we're at the 17 yard line. And here we go to James K. Polk picking up seven on first down or rather two on first down. Washington going to run, and he fumbles the football. Picked up by the Patriots, now just over a minute. But we do have all three timeouts, so if we can get a stop here, that would be huge. And Donald Trump, speaking of huge, able to force a disruption, and George W. Bush coming in and stopping him. So now we're going to be using Donald Trump, third and eight. We need to build a wall, and uh, hopefully we can get the stop here. We came out in a blitz, but now we're going to switch into cover three, and... Tom Brady's just going to throw the football away. Um, honestly, there, I think he probably should have either taken the sack or ran it or thrown something other than an incompletion and made us use that timeout, but I'm not going to complain about it. As a massive punt forces us all the way back to the 22-yard line. So now we're going to go deep, and Andrew Jackson bails us out there. Not a great throw. But now we're going to run a little bit of hurry up, try to get the ball into the end zone. 
We run some crossing routes. We got to try to get the ball out of bounds because we don't want to use that last time out if we don't have to. But here we're going to go deep and it's going to be incomplete. Almost intercepted. Got very, very, very lucky there that Harmon dropped that football. And now we're going to run a smash concept. Not the best throw, but Thomas Jefferson breaks a tackle and he's going to go into the end zone for the touchdown. 42 yard touchdown pass. And now Millard Fillmore doing the most important thing that he may ever do. And that's kick the PAT. And the Presidents are leading the Patriots by one point with nine seconds left in the fourth quarter. And there's Barack Obama making his first play of the game. He's been pretty quiet at that wide receiver position. But we got one more play. Tom Brady going deep and intercepted. William Henry Harrison, the shortest tenured president ever making a very, very important play there. So that is it, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. Drop a comment below letting us know who your favorite president is. But so that this doesn't get topical, let's go with your favorite president before Richard Nixon. And with that, guys, if you're new around here, remember to subscribe. And until next time, thanks for watching.